Do you remember these nostalgic PBS Kids shows? Here's what your favorite says about you. You're not a normal dog person, you're an advanced dog person. You have more compassion for dogs than you have for people, which isn't really saying much considering you don't really like most human beings and would rather watch a terrier play Sherlock Holmes instead of Benedict Cumberbatch. You like writing and drawing. You learn things best by doing them over and over again until you get really good at them. You also tend to get songs stuck in your head and your brain feels like an old broken CD player. It's always stuck on one song and if you want to change that, someone's going to need to get in there with a pair of pliers to jiggle some stuff around. People who complain that you're too socially conscious just need to go back and watch some 90s programming to see the utopia you were promised if you just believed in yourself versus the awful nightmare world you got where everyone is calling you delusional for wanting food and healthcare. The stuff in your closet tells a lovely yet manic story. Every colorful outfit, every old sketchbook, every little piece of junk glued to another piece of junk is just sitting there like a graveyard of your attempts to express yourself and there's probably more personality in your rattiest pair of jeans than in most people's entire bodies. I feel like you two had a childhood home that had a brown floral pattern couch where you spent most of your time playing with toys that were lovingly sewn together by hand.